Famed dinosaur hunter Luis Chiappe, director of the Dinosaur Institute, a curator at the Natural History Museum of Los Angeles County, and author of several notable books, returned to Utah this summer to excavate the skeleton of a sauropod his team discovered last summer. The only problem was, as the group was preparing to work in the area, Chiappe realized that he needed some extra help at the site. Jackhammers and sledgehammers were simply not enough to clear the tons of rock so that the bone bed could be properly exposed. So, he called in some help, a 90,000 pound modern dinosaur driven by a folksy Colorado cowboy named Royce Herman. In a stunning display of control, touch, and brute force, Herman made his way up the hill. However, he couldn't find the proper angle to remove the gigantic slab of sandstone that was preventing the scientists from getting to the bone. But then I guess you're going to come up over here, right? After remapping a strategy with Kiabi, Mr. Herman somehow, some way, got his machine on top of the hill. And with Kiabi watching, he performed a ballet of mountain munching until finally the slab was free. Come on. This allowed the paleontologists the access they needed. And over the course of the next day or so, the work proceeded, methodically, efficiently, in the scorching summer sun. Soon, they had reached just what they had come for. The sauropod began to reveal itself. Back at camp, the mood was celebratory. Chiappe tended to his other passion, barbecue he learned growing up in Argentina. He was satisfied knowing the expedition could now go as planned, thanks to a Colorado cowboy and his 90,000-pound helper. After a long day in the Utah desert, for AOL News, this is Chris Epting.